Welcome back everybody, and today I have behind me a horizontal double piston extender design. So if I just press this button, you can see that we have a double retraction and double extension. A little bit of a 1.14 lag spike there, so we'll go ahead and do it again. And another 1.14 lag spike. It's just because I'm recording, and that's how it works. But if we place a block right here, we can actually make this design too tall because this block allows for quasi-connectivity. And of course, if I remove that block right there, actually keep it there so you can see that it also extends. If I remove it, you get a single block retraction and extension on the bottom. but it does it in the same go. So if you want to just have this as a one tall extender, it is actually quite compact at two by two by four. But if we add in this block, we can make it more functional. And of course, it has the ability to use two blocks. So let's go ahead and get started with the tutorial. So slash Set. Actually, I probably have it saved in log for a dispenser. There we go. Okay, now that I've remembered to grab the button, go ahead and place a block there. Repeater set to 3. Any sort of piston right there could be sticky or regular. Observer there and there. Observer facing out, down, and over like so into a block two pistons like so, a dropper or a dispenser or a lamp I do believe will also work. No, not a lamp. Uh, a note block would work. Or maybe even a piston, but for simplicity, just a dropper will do fine. And an observer right there. Go ahead and place the block you're extending right there. Double extension. Double retraction. Now if you want to make this too tall, block there, piston piston, and a block right there. Double extension, double retraction. But anyway, that's going to do it for today's episode. So like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye!